This nugget is on gaseous exchange. So what is gas exchange? To exchange means to swap. Gas exchange is when gases swap over across some sort of surface, for example, a cell membrane. Humans exchange carbon dioxide and oxygen with the air they breathe. This is where the respiratory system and the cardiovascular system link together. In humans, gas exchange takes place in the lungs. Air is inhaled, breathed in and moves into the lungs. In the lungs, oxygen moves into the bloodstream and carbon dioxide moves out of the bloodstream. The two gases are exchanged. The air in the lungs, now with more carbon dioxide and less oxygen in it, is then exhaled or breathed out. Lungs are responsible for gas exchange. Humans have millions of tiny air sacs inside their lungs called alveoli. The alveoli are the site of gas exchange. The singular is alveolus. Let's look at the exchange of oxygen first. The air you breathe in is around 21% oxygen. This is a higher concentration than in your blood. So the oxygen diffuses from the alveoli into the blood and then diffuses into a red blood cell which carries the oxygen around your body to where it is needed. Oxygen combines with haemoglobin in the red blood cells to form oxyhemoglobin. Carbon dioxide is a waste product and needs to be removed from the body. It is carried in the plasma. The concentration in the blood is much higher than in the air, so the carbon dioxide diffuses from the blood into the alveoli and then you breathe it out to remove the carbon dioxide. Haemoglobin in the blood can also carry carbon dioxide. Of course, the diffusion of oxygen and carbon dioxide actually happens at the same time. Alveoli have a very good blood supply. Capillaries surround each alveolus and blood flows past to exchange oxygen and carbon dioxide. The good blood supply is important for maintaining the concentration gradients. We want the concentration of oxygen to be high in the alveolus and low in the blood to ensure oxygen diffuses this way. Oxygen is whisked away into the bloodstream as soon as it diffuses across. This makes sure that the concentration gradient of oxygen is maintained and maximises the rate of diffusion. To make sure that carbon dioxide is removed from the bloodstream efficiently, we want the concentration of carbon dioxide to be lower in the alveolus than it is in the blood. Ventilating the lungs, this means breathing in and out, removes the carbon dioxide and brings in fresh oxygen rich air. Doing this maintains a concentration gradient of carbon dioxide and oxygen. There are a number of features that make gaseous exchange so efficient. Firstly, the alveoli have lots of capillaries surrounding them. This ensures there is a good blood supply and means oxygen is able to diffuse into the blood quickly. Participating in regular physical activity increases capillarization at the alveoli and makes gaseous exchange even more efficient. The alveoli have moist thin walls and capillaries are only one cell thick, therefore a very short diffusion distance for gases to travel. The alveoli has a large surface area, making gaseous exchange even more efficient. The oxygen and carbon dioxide diffuse between the alveoli and capillary. Diffusion is a movement of gas from a high concentration to a low concentration. In summary, gaseous exchange takes place between the alveoli and capillaries in the lungs. In the alveoli, oxygen diffuses into the blood and carbon dioxide diffuses out of the blood. There are a number of features that assist gaseous exchange at the alveoli. The alveoli have a large surface area. The alveoli have moist thin walls and the capillaries are only one cell thick. There is a short distance for the diffusion of oxygen and carbon dioxide. The alveoli have lots of capillaries and a large blood flow and the movement of gas from a high concentration to a low concentration. Our key words. Concentration is the amount of something in one place described as either high or low. Diffusion is the spreading out of particles of a gas from an area of a higher concentration to an area of a lower concentration. The alveoli are tiny air sacs in the lungs that increase the rate of gaseous exchange. The singular is alveolus.
The capillary is the smallest blood vessel where gaseous exchange occurs in and out of the blood. Surface area is the total area of exposed surfaces. And haemoglobin is responsible for transporting oxygen in the blood around the body.